How's it going guys, Archer Black C here, and uh, I am returning back after opening all my uh, Bakugan from earlier. Uh, I can be a little louder now because I'm not nervous from all the uh, people being behind me. Uh, but I am working with these Bakugan to make a deck for uh, the tournament that is tomorrow, or whenever you're watching this, I don't know, on uh, Sunday. So, uh, I've got Dragonoid Ultra, Halcor Ultra, Hydra's Ultra, Nilius Ultra, and Chaos, and uh, Chaos Dragonoid. And so I have a wide spread here. Uh, and I have a lot to work with, so I have no idea. I'm not going to build the deck on this video or anything. I'm just going to open the packs, but I just kind of wanted to show you all what I was working with, uh, and then I'll make a deck profile on whatever I end up making, uh, and if I do well or whatever. So we're going to go ahead and uh, bust over these packs. So we'll take a look at the pack art and everything, uh, since this is kind of the first time. We have the new Bakugan Pro labeling and branding there, which is really cool, and the new uh, set icon, which I really like. Uh, I like the... I like the design of it. It's pretty cool. The uh, like the triangle there, and it kind of levels out the pack and everything. It's awesome. New art for Dragonoid with his big uh, gun there. Uh, pack wise, I think everything's pretty much the same. Yeah, nothing, nothing too different. Uh, oh, these have the little uh, for the shelf, like hanging on the shelf thing. I didn't even notice that till just now. Uh, so that's cool. Um, but we will see. We still have a pull tab. Let's see if these are better. Put it down. Yeah, I'd say that's better. All right, cool. Um, so now uh, on the back of the packs, we get these little art cards. Uh, I know that Magic does this, so it's kind of nice to have this for us too. Uh, I mean, they're not really anything special. Uh, learn how to play, tells you all that stuff, download the app, all the good stuff. But now you have these cool little art things, so you can use these, I don't know, maybe use them for dividers or something. They're the same size as cards, but whatever. All right, let's go, first pack. So we have all new cards, so I'm gonna try to go through as fast as I can, but as slow as I can at the same time. Uh, Swirling Darkness, two energy. It's a dual cost, or dual uh, energy, dual faction, Jesus, sorry. <laughs> dual faction flip card. Uh, non, stop non-darkest and non-aquas, so that is interesting. I'm gonna separate these into colors. Divine Evolution, this is another uh, dual faction card, two energy. 200B and to attack. If you have Trifecta, which is uh, something that is with uh, Ventus and I think uh, Chaos, they I think the ones when they do these uh, share the um, ability like that, uh, usually. Uh, Trifecta, if your Bakugan have three or more Bakugan cores attached to them, you get 500B and five uh, attack instead. And for two, that's pretty, pretty good. Uh, I like that a lot. Another dual uh, faction. We have one cost for minus five damage. Um, that's not bad. Uh, it's kind of like one of those cards that's like an in-hand flip, almost. Or how I treat them, anyway. Oh, how are you going to organize these if they're dual? Oh, that's kind of annoying, but whatever. <laughs> I didn't even think about that. Uh, Carapace Spin. One energy, plus 100B, and one uh, draw a card. Uh, this is the new draw a card. Uh logo or whatever you want to call it uh, but it's pretty self-explanatory it's a card lifting off the deck so that's what you need to do care of a spin cool that's aquas I'm gonna just do that uh, ice barrage three energy for five frost strike uh, I don't use frost strike often so that doesn't necessarily uh, impress me too much but burrowing blow uh, I don't know who this Bakugan is I guess he's like a beetle or like a tick or something uh, pretty cool. Uh, this is 5 energy for plus 1200B. Uh, that's a lot of B power uh, for a card like this. Uh, 5 energy though, uh, especially for the format we're going to be doing tomorrow. I don't know if I'm going to use this or not, but we'll take a look at it for sure. Leah and Dan. So um, just before I even say anything, no, this does not count for Maximus Dragonoid. I asked, I got it clarified extremely early so we don't have to worry about it. But Leah and Dan... Four cost, you may empower cards for free. Uh, empowering means that... Empower cards for free? Does that mean you get to play stuff? Uh, any card that has the empower effect, you can get that effect for free, but I don't know if you can play it. Does it say you can play it? No, it says you may empower cards for free. Uh, it just means empower you can use, just means... It means you can use the effect if it's on the card, but like you can't play it. Right, okay, so um, we'll see it later. Oh, here we go. So here's an Empower. When you play this, you may pay an additional three energy for uh, something else. 
right? Uh, so it's like giving you a choice to pay for something. So this kind of works with cards like this, and now I have them, uh, but I don't have Pyrus Nilius Ultra. Uh, but that is an interesting card uh, for sure. But Hyper Nilius Ultra, we have three energy, uh, 700B, eight attack, uh, and power. I just read it for you. So uh, very cool. I like, I like the Evos in this uh, set. All right, our first uh, Baku gear. Uh, again, these don't have anything to do with the toys, uh, competitive wise, uh, you, you can separate these completely. So you have the cards and you have the toys, which are just kind of aesthetic pieces, uh, which I like. That's awesome. Uh, we have three energy trifecta. If your Bakugan have three or more Baku cores attached to them, plus seven damage, uh, and it's giving you a universal 200, uh, B, uh, for just being on that Bakugan. So that's pretty cool. Um, that is interesting. I, I, I'm not sure what Bakugan I'm picking. I have to wait to see all the cards I get. Uh, so I don't know. have our first Hex of the new set, which is Spring of Life. Five energy. Uh, draw three cards. You may energize a card in your hand uncharged. That's really cool for Ventus, because Ventus does not have a lot of drawing uh, power right now. Uh, this is an expensive card, uh, but um, this is the best draw engine for Ventus, but it's mixed with Aquas, and that's why. Uh, so that's really cool. Um, <clears throat> I don't know if you can ramp up to five. That might be a decent option. I'm going to keep the hexes to the side. All right, let's keep moving on. Um, if we get doubles, I'm just going to blow past them. Uh, and, yeah, see, they, the packs still do that. But whatever. <laughs> I'm just really bad at it. But now they give you, they do this now at the top. So well, maybe not. I don't know. I'm still bad at it. There we go. trash after this. Here we go. Darkest. Uh, Darkest Tsunami. Uh, four cost. This is a dual. A lot of dual cards. A lot more than I <clears throat> than I remember seeing up on the wall. Four cost. 500B and 5 uh, attack. That is not the worst thing in the world. Um, I like adding B and attack at the same time because if you win, I mean, you obviously get a, get a bigger hit there. So that's pretty cool. And for four, that's not that's not the worst thing in the world. I like. I think I like that card uh, for tomorrow, maybe. Dark Rain, a two energy. Uh, Darkest Aquas and four attack. Uh, Sync, you may reveal the Baku Gear card in your hand for 400B. So Sync is this new thing where uh, it'll tell you to reveal a type of card in your hand. And if you have it, then you can do this effect. So it's like, do you have the card in your hand? Yes, you get the effect. If you don't, you don't get the secondary effect. It's pretty cool. Um, so sync, you may reveal a Baku Gear card in your hand for 400B. So if I have this Baku Gear card and I play it, or if I have it in my hand, I get an extra uh, bonus there. Interesting. Very interesting. Flip card here. Tail Whip, 3 energy, stop Chaos and Ventus. Choose a player to discard a card. Uh, so it's a darkest card that does discarding stuff pretty normal. Here we go, Giant Inferno, two cost for double strike. That's pretty awesome, um, especially for like Midas Indius decks, I think. Uh, when they win, they normally hit you with a lot of B power, because of uh, damage, and that's what they you know fight with for Sindius, Midas Indius decks. And uh, for two energy, you can double that, which is pretty crazy, uh, if you ask me. So, very cool. Pyrus Vortex, three energy, five damage, uh, plus five damage, rapid fire, the second rapid fire card you uh, card you play this turn is free. So rapid fire is also new. Uh, that is, uh, it's kind of a built-in combo move into an ability. Uh, it's kind of like forcing you into a combo, not forcing you, but it allowing you into like an actual combo of many effects for a cheap price. So if I play this three cost, and I have another uh, rapid fire card in my hand that's five, um, that card ends up being free. So I get uh, some crazy combo action going. Really interesting. Uh, I'm interested to see how many of these I get. Uh, Pyra Scorch, one energy. That's three damage. Uh, pretty straightforward. Nothing much to say with that. Uh, Fade Ninja Baku Rider. What? <laughs> this is a hero card. And it's Fade Ninja and Halcor from the animated series on YouTube. That's I, have, I didn't see this on the wall. This is awesome. <laughs> three energy. Darkest Aquas, when you reveal a card from your hand, uh, when you reveal a card in your, when you reveal a card in your hand, a 
Bakugan gets 300B. Oh, I guess that's playing into, uh, what was it called? I forgot what it's called. Sync. So you have to reveal a card. That's interesting. That's good. I feel like that's a good card. I'll have to look into it. Uh, but I think that's what that's doing. That's pretty cool for three. And being a hero, that's that's something. Oh, here we go. All right, so this is our new base. This is basically the new antagonist of uh, season two. Uh, uh, told that that was told to me by one of the uh, guys. Uh, we don't. We didn't get official uh, confirmation of that. But this is going to be like the antagonist of season two. Uh, Diamond Enoch Ultra. Uh, it's a nine cost. So we have a Diamond Evolution again. Uh, fourteen fourteen. So that's pretty stout, but nine en nine energy is just a lot. Uh, maybe you can cheat this out some way and make it worth it, but <laughs> by itself, not really. And let's see what our hex is. Oh, not there yet, actually. Sorry, just kidding. Oh, dark rage. This is a rare though, uh, super rare. Uh, a five cost, Pyrus Darkus, um, and a minus five. And this turn, the victor is decided by highest. Uh, Damage instead of be power, so it's my Descendius, uh, but you're lowering your opponent's uh, damage. That's kind of nasty. <laughs> That's going to be really hard to get around, actually. Uh, but for five damage, five energy, it's a lot more uh, to deal with. So that's going to be interesting to see how well people use this card. Uh, maybe it splashes into my Descendius for late game or something like that. Um, but really interesting. Uh, I don't know. We'll have to see. I'm getting a lot of what I think are good Pyrus cards, so which is good because I definitely want to use this Dragonoid. Here we go. Lily is Lily is Lily her little bunny? That's kind of cool. Uh, but this is our hex. It's a seven cost Aquas Ventus. Um, you draw an additional card each turn. Cool. You may energize an additional card from your hand each turn. Wow. Cool. That's neat. I like that. If you can cheat it out somehow or ramp to it later. I mean, turn five or six, you should have seven energy in, uh, in Ventus if you last that long. So that's a thing. It's a possible thing. Cool. Uh, and we have Feral as our art card. It's kind of cool. I like these little art things. All right. Let's keep it rolling. Alright, we're starting off, starting off with a Baku gear. We have Dark Helm, uh, which is a really cool looking art. It's like a helmet. It's pretty dope. Uh, three energy, and you get 200B and two attack. Uh, pretty basic. Uh, not much to say. It does what it is. Another Baku gear. Dark Daggers. Four energy, 200B, five attack. So that's kind of a step up from our last one there for uh, one more energy cost. So that's kind of cool, I guess. Giving you options. More Baku gear. Oh, we have four Baku gear in a row, actually. Bolt blow, two energy, uh, two frost strike, 100B, and zero attack. I'm not sure about that one. Um, Guardian wings, three energy. When you play this, draw a card. Uh, 100B, three attack. Okay. Um, Aqua slime, three energy. Uh, stop Chaos and Pyrus, and draw two cards. A lot more drawing stuff going on. I mean, that's Aquas, so that's what they get anyway. But still, uh, I'm seeing a little more of that. Natural Defenses is Aventus, three cost for stopping Darkus and Pyrus. Energize this uncharged. I like these uh, Ventus flips that let you charge. Uh, I'm, I'm just a fan of them. Like, I like uh, photosynthesis and stuff. Hyper Pegatrix. Uh, this is a energy or two energy card for 707. Empower, when you play this, you may play an additional three energy to draw a card. Uh, so if you pay five to play this, so like later game, if you didn't get this earlier, uh, you can do that. Uh, and you'll get a reasonably statted Evo for two energy. Um, probably outclassed by some things, though. Uh, and now we have Diamond Pegatrix Ultra. Nine cost. 1712, though. <laughs> kind of crazy. Um... Uh, I don't have this Bakugan, so I really don't even need to look at it right now, but here we go. Uh, Aqua's Crest, we have four energy, four damage. Uh, if you have, this is boost, I actually haven't seen this yet. If you have seven or more energy cards in play, plus 12 damage instead. So they want you to run Aqua's with Ventus, that's cool. 
Interesting. I didn't see this on the wall. That's brand new for me. Uh, wow, cool. I like that a lot. Uh, Chaotic Flare. Uh, that is one cost, three damage. You may empower the next card you play this turn for free. Cool. I need to look into this empower stuff. I guess I'm not wrapping my hand or head around it yet, but I like this. This seems okay, and it's in Hex, and it's a beautiful art, so can't go wrong there. All right, Feral for the art card. Let's go. I'm looking for the the new Maximus Dragonoid uh, old school, because he's nuts. <laughs> Art-wise, and he's a bleat, and I have Dragonoid Ultra, so that's really what I'm trying to go for. Flame Jump, uh, three cost, Aquas, Ventus, make it Pyrus Attack for three. Very cool. Um, might have to use that. Uh, per Pyro Portal, Py Pyro Portal, two energy, stop non, uh, non Pyrus, non Darkus. Okay, cool. Like that. Ooh, Pyrus Titan Trucks. Uh, five cost, uh, 220 damage. <laughs> so there's a card that lets you pay an energy cost to do damage to your opponent for the amount of damage a Bakugan has. And so that's literally what this card is for, basically. I don't know what it is. I don't know the name. If we run into it, I'll let you know. Uh, but don't look at this and think it's dumb. <laughs> Until we can figure out if that other card is good, too. Because uh, this is nuts. <laughs> 20 damage. Written down on a card is, is a lot. Uh, Pyrus Scorch, one energy, three damage. Pyrus Vortex, three energy, five uh, damage. Rapid Fire, so the second Rapid Fire card you play this turn is free. Very cool. I like all these Pyrus cards I'm getting. Giant Inferno, two damage, uh, double strike. Spring of Life, we saw that earlier, so get another look at it. Lava Lash, two energy. You can only play this before rolling. Interesting, I've never seen that text before. This turn, your Bakugan gets Victor uh, plus four energy. Okay, that'll take a second to think about, but interesting. Hmm. Oh, you could ramp into like Evos with that because you have to use it at the end of the turn anyway. You pay to. Interesting, cool. I'll look into that card. Here we go. Oh, Pyrosana. This is the new, this is an ode. Uh, to that old Pyrus card where Dragonoid's sitting in the uh, lava thing. So now we have Cycloid uh, sitting in a sauna. That's very cool. Uh, three energy. This is a uh, awesome rare. Uh, reveal the top card of your deck. You may play any non-flip cards revealed this way for free. So we get a, uh, a Dan out of this, I guess. Uh, in power, you may play an additional three to return this to your hand. Wow. Do I like this card? I don't know. I'm keeping my uh, keeping my thoughts to myself. Deep Vines, three energy, minus 400B, so a Ventus card here. Boost, if you have seven or more energy cards in play, minus eight. Uh, that's not the worst thing in the world. Uh, and it's in Hex, so that's interesting. I like that. Cool, 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 cool. There we go. Right, we're starting off with a card we just saw. Deep Vines. Oh, my favorite art of the whole set. Here we go. Nature's Wrath. It's Trox as Godzilla running over boats in the ocean getting struck by lightning. What do you want other than this card? <laughs> Seven energy plus 2,000 beat power. Yes. <laughs> this is not undoable. Like, this is, like, not doable, I mean. Like, this is a Ventus card where you ramp up to seven relatively quickly, that's giving you 2,000 B power. I love it. And I love the art. I need this in Hex. I need a playset in Hex. I don't know what else to say. Baku Crusher, three energy, 300 B and plus three damage. Pretty uh, reasonable, I would say. Um, I don't even know my organization anymore. Max React, two energy, uh, plus two damage, and plus um, Shadow Strike. Uh, <laughs> That and symbol threw me off for a second. Uh, sync, you may reveal a card in your hand that costs two energy for five damage instead. Interesting. Uh, okay. Darkest Slice, one energy, uh, 200B. Um, that seems a little weak. Darkest Storm, five energy, plus 11. 
Uh, I don't know about that one, but looks cool. Leah and Winton. So again, this doesn't count for Maximus. Uh, three energy. Your Bakugan have Victor attach a red, a green fist from the field to this. Oh, okay. So uh, if you win, you get a green fist to add more damage. Cool. I can uh, I can handle that. Winton the Hungry. This. <laughs> This does count for Maximus, um, for those of you out there worried about that. Uh, it's a one-cost win, so we're in that world now. Uh, trifecta, if your Bakugan have three or more Bakugans attached to them, your Bakugan gets plus three damage and Shadow Strike. So, uh, no matter what you think about the ability, uh, we now have a one-cost win. So, do with that information uh, whatever you want to do with it. Crystallize, two energy. Uh, Two Frost Strike, if the opposing player plays a flip card this turn, draw two cards. That's cool. Um, I don't know about the playability of that. Aquokinesis. Cool card names in this set. Uh, one energy, you get 200B. Sync, if you reveal a card in your hand that costs one energy to re-roll. You may reveal a card that costs one energy in your hand to re-roll your Bakugan. So a one cost re-roll, you just have to have a uh, another one cost card in your hand. Maybe Super Fuel. Um... A couple other things. That's all I'm thinking about right now. But, uh, yeah. Very interesting. Cool. And Pegatrix art card. Sweet. Oh, that's a hex. Put that down here. Alright. Darkest Ash. This is a new card. One energy. Uh, three damage. Rapid fire. The second rapid card. Uh, rapid fire card you play this turn is free. Uh, Baku block, two energy, uh, stop non-Ventus, non-Heos, just a, uh, stop there. Pyro, Pyro Obliterator, <laughs> that's a cool card, card name. Pyro Obliterator, two energy, plus 700 damage, uh, 700 B power. That's, uh, not the worst thing in the world. That's kind of a Heos ability on a Pyrus card, so that's, that's good for Pyrus, um, I like that card, and probably gonna play it more. Uh, Focus fire, three damage, three energy plus five hundred B. Empower, you may play an additional three energy for double strike and three frost strike. That's pretty. That's a lot going on, but that is uh, that's not bad <laughs> as well. Uh, I'm liking some of these pirates cards. Cosmic fireball, two energy, stop a non chaos and non pirates. Flip card. Uh, lightning wing. Three energy, stop Darkus or Aquas. Attach two Baku cores from the field to one of your open Bakugan. To, so you're just remo you're just removing cores from the field. That's just have to think about that one. Uh, Hyper Pegatrix saw that already. Uh, Diamond Pegatrix saw that already. Uh, Ventus Cyclonator. Uh oh, a rare. What does this do? This is a awesome rare. Uh, three energy boost. When you play this card, if you have seven or more energy cards and play five damage, 100 B, 100, one damage. Why is this a rare? Why, what's so good about it? It's not the best thing in the world. It's got chalks on it, so I can't be mad. Very cool. Uh, Giant Inferno. Really cool looking art on the hex here. Uh, two energy for uh, double strike. Cool. Still searching for this Maximus. Our 80 Baku Elite right now, really, uh, would be cool. Um, but that Dragonoid is just really gonna seal the deal for me here. Ventus Link. Vent Vent Ventus Inc. Ventus Inc. This guy's like a Xenomorph. Uh, we did not get a toy revealed of him, but he's really cool. 3 Energy minus 600B. I like that. I like Ventus cards like that. Deep Vines we saw. Nature's Wrath. I got another one. I love it. Uh, Baku Crusher, we've seen this already. Yeah, three cost, three, three. Max React, two energy, uh, two damage, and Shadow Strike Sync, uh, a two energy for five damage instead. Cool. Um, Darkest Slice, we saw a second ago. Get a look at it. Uh, Leah and Winton, saw that a second ago. Chaos Deflection, two energy. You can only play this before rolling. This turn, your Bakugan gets Victor, draw three. I like that. That's pretty cool. You have to win. With, oh, here we go. <laughs> Bakugan Elite Maximus Pegatrix Ultra. Uh, six energy. Uh, really cool art here. 
Uh, 11 damage, 11 B power, 7 damage. When this opens, attach all Baku cores on a poke. <laughs> I saw this on the wall. When this opens, attach all Baku cores on opposing Bakugan to this. That's crazy. <laughs> That's nuts, man. Like, <laughs> oh, I opened. Here, let me take everything you have and put it on me. Attach all Baku cores on opposing Bakugan to this. Oh, man. What if you did this to an HTN? Really <laughs> piss off an HTN player? <laughs> I like this card. <laughs> I feel like that's something that is going to be really cool. So uh, I got a Baku Elite there. Hyper Nilius Ultra. Three damage. Three energy. I miss speaking. I, I'm on like four hours of sleep. Sorry. Eight a B power. Four damage. When this has a Baku gear attached to it. Plus 700 B7? That's not the worst thing in the world. Three cost? I like that a lot, actually. Cool. Uh, Nilius art card. Sweet. All right, we've got three more packs. Starting to get some uh, doubles and stuff here, so it shouldn't be too long. We did good, though. We got it. We got an elite. We can't be, we can't be too mad, especially with a brand new set. So, All right, focus fire. Three energy. We saw this a second ago. Pretty cool. Cosmic Fireball, two energy, stop non Heos, non Pyrus. Take it. Uh, Lightning Wing, we saw that earlier. Uh, wing Arrow, three energy, plus five damage. That's cool. Uh, Prism Blast, uh, two energy, 300B. Uh, if you have Trifecta, uh, 700B instead for two energy. That's pretty cool. Um, Hey, Heyo Crescents. Heyo Crescents. Uh, one energy for 300B. I think there's better things to play in your deck in Heyos. Ventus 4. Two energy uh, with Winton's like, new Bakugan, which we haven't seen. Uh, I don't think we know what this is yet. You can only play this before rolling. This turn, your Bakugan gets Victor. Energize the top two cards of your deck uncharged. So it's a, it plays into Ventus stuff. That's pretty cool. Um, Heaven and Earth Strike. That's cool. Uh, so re-roll your Bakugan. If that Bakugan opens on the re-roll, you may attach an additional Baku core from the field to it. That's cool. I like this card. Ventus and Heos. It's a Hey. Oh, you have to play Ventus though. Ooh, that worked. This works so well for HTN with Ventus Pegatrix. Ooh, that's cool. I like this. I like it a lot. I like it a lot. Titan Feral, Darkest. Very cool. Uh, five energy, twelve hundred five sync. When this opens, you can a uh, reveal an Evo in your hand uh, for plus damage equal to that Evo's Evo. That's cool. Very cool card. And our hex is Dark Rage. Uh, Dark Rage is a five cost. I think we looked at it. Five damage. Uh, the uh, yeah, this is that Mitosendius card. So cool. All right, two more. A lot of these cards. Are exciting. I have to say they're at least exciting, even if you got bad feelings about something, which honestly I don't care about right now. Darkest Ash, one energy. We saw that already. Let's get through this. Uh, Baku Block, uh, non Ventus, non Chaos. Pyro Obliterator, we just saw that. Focus Fire, uh, we've seen this a couple times. I think it's a playset now. Cosmic Fireball, non Chaos, non Pyrus. Lightning Wing, had that already. Oop, a new Baku gear for Ventus, which I'm okay with. Four energy, when you play this, energize the top card of your deck uncharged. Plus 400B and uh, zero. So this is like what I'm talking about. If you can get a Baku gear with high B power and put it on this Nilius, I mean 800, 700, 400, you're doing all right. That's 1900? That's, that's pretty cool, man. I like it. I like it a lot. Oh, here's the new Vicious Lightning card. <laughs> lightning Tail Chaser. Uh, he's freaking out because he's chasing his tail. So, uh, three energy. Sync, you can reveal a card in your hand with the same name as the card you played to uh, draw a card. That's very cool. Uh, very nice, very nice. Crystallize, uh, two energy. Two Frost Strike, an opposing player flips a card this turn. Uh, plays a flip card this turn, draw two cards. We saw that earlier. That's pretty cool. Ooh. Oh! Cool. Oh, the art. Oh, the art's great. Oh, I love it. Hypertrax. Um, three energy. 
805. Sorry if you hear the beeping outside. I'm almost done. We're just going to power through this video. Let's go. Trifecta, if your Bakugan have three or more Baka cores attached to them, plus 400B. So, um, I think this is better than the old core trucks. That's for sure. Uh, and I think there's a Maximus trucks too. If I'm not mistaken, I might be though. Uh, this is all very fresh and raw, so I don't really remember everything because they showed us everything at once today. We literally walked through the door and they had the entire set of cards up on the wall, so it's kind of nuts. All right, last one. Let's see what we can do here. All right. Rocket Bracers, four energy. When you play this, make a Pyrus attack for one. Uh, that's 303. That's pretty cool. For four, I think it's doable. So I like that. Pyro Hammer, this is the one that comes with Dragonoid, so I have two now. Six, uh, 112. Uh, Hyper Dragonoid Ultra, love this card. Love this card art. Um, 801, when you land on a Helix, you get plus 11, though. That's nuts. It's very cool. Um, I haven't pulled many Oralist cards at all. At all, at all, actually. Interesting. Uh, Sting Laser, 5 energy, 500B, and draw a card. Cool. Uh, Aqua Kinesis, did we look at this already? Yeah, 1 energy, 200B. Uh, Tempest Generator. Uh, two energy. When you play this card, you may re-roll this Bakukan. Cool to re-roll. And it's a two cost. See, this is cool. It's a two cost re-roll, which is something that we already have, but now you get to attach it. So, like, it already does something that we want and need and use, but now we also get something off of it. When you play this, you may re-roll this Bakugan. Yeah, I mean, great. That's cool. Uh, Went in the Hungry, we've seen this already. Uh, Spring of Life, we've also seen this. Titan Nilius, so the new Titan Nilius here. Very cool. Looks great. 5 energy, 13-5. Sync reveal a card in your hand that, that costs 5 energy or more for plus 10. Very neat. I like that. And our final card here is Dark Rain with Nilius on it. 2 energy. For damage, sink. You may reveal a Bakugir card in your hand for plus 400B. So, very cool. Uh, I'm really liking this set. I hope we get more packs tomorrow because uh, I just want to open these. <laughs> but uh, I guess our highlights here this is some of the hexes I pulled. Um, but obviously, the main one is this Maximus Pegatrix Ultra. Very cool. Uh, I really like this card. I want to see this happen. Um, but yeah, thank you guys for watching. Uh, I know we're going to be, everybody's going to be pumping out a bunch of Bakugan content this weekend, uh, but I just wanted to show y'all what I did uh, so that when you see my deck profile, you know what I was working with. So I think it's warranted uh, its own video. So thank you guys for watching. I'll see you next time. Uh, and uh, just like and subscribe and do all the cool stuff that I ask you to do all the time. Thanks. Bye.